Okay, to make this bird trap, you're going to need the basic basket. Um, most people, they, they make their basket um, because if you're in the wild or out in the wilderness somewhere, you're not going to have a Rite Aid basket. But I happen to have one of these and I'm lazy, so I did that. That's my basket. The next, I don't really know what to call this, it's like a balancing stick. So it looks kind of like a seven. What it is is a tree branch. You can see how this one grew off that way and then this one grew off that way. I cut it to look like a seven. And then I put a notch right there on the back of it. And then um, also I angled the bottom just so that it can come in contact with the trigger stick a little bit better. This is the trigger. It's kind of like a wishbone type stick. And all I did was angle the bottom a little bit so that it'll hold on the balance stick a little bit. And then also you need a post in the ground. You can either get a stick and just make it to where it's uh, got a line at the top or notch both sides or just do something like this which is what I did. Now to set this trap it's going to be a little bit difficult to do it with it while I'm holding the camera but uh, let's see if I can get this to stand up. Okay, to set the trap you just kind of put that on there balance the trap the basket there and then wedge the trigger stick in the back of the uh, basket so that the weight of the basket is what keeps the balance stick um, it tra transfers the weight of the basket to the trigger stick and voila it's set and then if a bird comes along, there's some bird seed in there, and they step on this stick, it uh, drops the basket. So this is the result of the bird trap. I got two of these little guys in here. Not really sure what they are, but they've been eating all my grass seeds. Drive me nuts. I'll probably just let them go though. I'm not going to eat them or kill them or 